Hello, this is Dr. Linda Davis, and today I'm working in GIMP, and I want to um, take an image and just move something around on the image. Now, I'm going to start up GIMP, of course, file open, find the image I want to work on. I'm going to work on the uh, Walmart logo. Just got it from Google Images. There's lots of, if you search on company logos in Google Images, you'll find lots of logos to use. So I'm going to stretch this out just a little bit to see it better. And I have a little asterisk over here, or the little sun, however they mean for it to be, but I want to take it and move it to the other side, just for an example piece. So, um, let me start off with my rectangular select tool in the toolbox, right there. Okay, and then I'm going to just take the asterisk, or the sun. Um, if I find myself a little close over here, I'm just going to position my mouse and pull it over just a little bit more. Doesn't have to be perfect, but close enough. And then I want to go up to edit and cut, which is control X and go back up to edit and select paste as new layer so not regular paste but paste as and then go down to new layer and it just pops it anywhere along in here it's up to you to move it to where you want it to be so go up to move the move tool in your toolbox select that and then you can grab and move it wherever you want it to do and for our purposes today I'm just moving it to the other side like that okay now uh, let's get some of these um, select boxes out of here so I go up to select and select none get rid of that one and the last step because I do have two layers going on now if you look over at your layers um, dialog box over here you've got what you had on the clipboard which was the little sun symbol and then you have the background so we're going to merge those visible layers and so to do that you have to go up to image and down to merge visible layers control M if you like to use shortcuts and you'll get a dialog box that comes up that says merge layers yes you want to merge expanded as necessary is fine hit merge and that puts it all together now when you move things around like that sometimes you've got you know your excess spacing over here that you really don't have to have uh, if you want to take it one step further you can uh, crop it down to the size that you want. In that case, just again, your select, rectangular select tool. Um, maybe I'll start over here, but just kind of crop it a little closer there. Okay. And then I'll go up to image and down to crop to selection which just tightens it up a bit. Okay, so there's actually two different things going on there. We were moving items around and we were also cropping it down. Hope that helps you in your pursuit of GIMP skills.